In this short video tutorial, I will demonstrate how to create any art style in Photoshop using Generate to Fill AI. We will transform a photo into a digital art piece within a minute. So without wasting any time, let's get started. First locate the quick mask button and click on it to enable this feature. This feature will be the instrumental in this process. Next navigate to the edit menu and select fill. Choose the option for color and pick a shade of gray for the fill. Typically a range between 30% to 40% works well. For this example, let's go with 30% gray. After selecting the color, click OK to close the color picker and then click OK again to exit the fill dialog box. You will notice the image turning reddish. We don't need to worry. Now we need to exit the quick mask mode. Simply click on the quick mask icon once more. Now it's time to apply the generate to fill. Click on the generate to fill tool and type in the desired art style you want to achieve. In this case, let's choose vector illustration digital art. Once you have entered the style you wanted, click on the generate button. Review the generated variations and choose the one that appeals to you the most. For this example, I prefer the second variation. It looks more unique and stylish. The AI generated content contains a lot of unwanted elements like this background lines overlapping the hair or other areas. If there are any unwanted elements like this, you can easily remove them. Grab the remove tool, create new layer and ensure the sample all layers option is selected. Paint over the unwanted areas to remove them effectively. Now we are almost finished, it's time to make some global adjustments to enhance the visual impact of the artwork. To do this, create a stamp visible copy, pressing Ctrl plus Shift plus Alt plus E or if you are using Mac, Command plus Shift plus Option plus E, then right click on the layer and convert it to a smart object. Now open this layer in Camera Raw Filter. Within the Camera Raw Filter, you can make adjustments to highlights, shadows, whites, blacks and contrast. Tweak these settings to make the art pop and stand out. As a final touch up, I'm going to add some detailing and effects to enhance the overall appearance of the art. Once you are satisfied with the changes, click OK to apply the settings and there you have it friends, here is before and after transformation. I hope you found this trick useful. If you are interested in discovering more Photoshop tricks and tips, remember to subscribe to PS Desire. Don't forget to hit the bell icon to receive notifications from our channel. Thanks for watching. Please like, share and comment. We appreciate your support. Stay tuned for more exciting videos, take care and happy editing.